Clinic in Action TV, the people's choice for hot topics. I would like to take a time to thank my subscribers for tuning in. Those who are new to the channel, please smash that subscribe button for further info and updates. As you can see, we're going to be talking about the most dangerous job. So before we get into this, I will advise you, please hit the subscribe button, be a part of the team, Trinity Connection TV. Don't forget to hit the like button and also the bell notification for further videos. So as you can see, the most dangerous job in Trinidad and Tobago is prison officer. And I'm going to tell you the reason why I come to the conclusion that the most dangerous job is a prison officer. The reason is the prison officer which works in the prison so he's amongst the criminals some people are gonna say the most dangerous job is being a police officer yes it is a dangerous job being a police officer but you gotta think about how long is a police officer dealing with the criminal they either arrest them take them to the police station run their papers through send them to a cell for the court date and then they go to prison but a prison officer works almost 8 to 12 hours with prisoners and they're working with some of the most notorious prisoners prisoners that have connections to the streets prisoners that got respect on the streets prisoners that can call shots from behind the bars and affect somebody on the outside so that's a very dangerous job and this goes on all around the world prison officers are being victims to the just by working in the prison because hear what they're trying to do their job in the prison but guess what them trying to do the job is affecting the criminals that are trying to do their own jobs. So if a prisoner, prison officer, come to a cell and tell a man, listen, you can't have a cell phone, we season that. You just stop that man from his connections to the streets and he's not going to take it lightly. He's going to have it in his mind, you are going to have to teach this guy a lesson. This guy took away my phone, this guy stop me from whatever they're doing and guess what when this prison officer leaves and goes home guess what these prisoners are making calls and telling people on the outside listen this man has given me trouble every time he here handle that so it's very difficult and very hard to be a prison officer that's why these type of jobs they deserve to get paid a lot of money because you're putting your life on the line every single day you're in the prison and a riot take place and you take the battle and you hit a criminal that is well respected in the street he's not going to take that because in his mind he have to make an example out of you so that others will know he's not a person to mess with and guess what these prisoners don't care these prisoners is going to make an example out of you so that is one of the jobs that people didn't even want to do it's a very very dangerous job look at the, the this year going here it's over close to six prison officers lost their life this young prison officer was only months on the force and guess what while washing the car vehicle pull up took his life and it ha most likely something to do with just being in the prison amongst these criminals amongst these criminals that has no pity for life so when you pick up these type of jobs just remember you're putting your life and your family at risk and it's hard to say do be a prison officer because somebody had to be a prison officer somebody had to do the job 
of keep holding these prisoners in jail and looking over them that's why the government need to put type of, some type of system in place to protect prison officers in situations like this if something happens to a prison officer if anybody's caught guilty of the act they're gonna have to have long sentences because it should be mandatory like if you look around the world certain homicides and murders there's a mandatory amount of years if you touch an officer it's like some countries is seven years life in jail life in jail if you hit a police officer in America it's like mandatory seven years just by you scuffling or fighting with them they get seven years these jobs are very very risky also jobs such as being a police officer because you're dealing with criminals anytime you all day dealing with criminals or trying to stop people from doing negative stuff negative stuff can come to you it's very risky so people let's be careful what you do if you're a prison officer watch how you move in the prisons try not to cross no boundaries or no lines with these people go in there and do your job mind your business and try to avoid certain situations because if you get too caught up in these type of things you're in the prison as a prison officer and you're trying to get too cool with the criminals and stuff like that you're putting your life at risk so people don't forget to write in the comment section what you think about this situation and what you think about these type of jobs and write also what all you think the government should do to try to solve this, these type of situations or fix these type of situations and if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button be a part of the team and you searching the Tobago again go to school for their education Keep your mind on the right path and avoid problems with people it's better to walk away and live to see another day than to try to go two to two with someone and guess what that person decide to take your life and guess what you're no longer here sometimes you have to just keep your mouth shut mind your own business and go about your life so people don't forget, hit the subscribe Thanks button. Thanks for tuning in with Trini Connection TV. Like and subscribe. If you're new to the channel, smash that subscribe button for further info and updates.